press the bell icon on the YouTube app and watch our new videos. So basically, my wardrobe has every shade in the Pantone color book. I like wearing flesh colored heels, skulls in between my fingers, Marsala nails, and the overrated, overindulged, over bloody burdened LBD. But there are six things there's no room for in this room. If you like colors of independence, singlehood and power, if you like layering yourself with ambition, if you want to wait for the right cut that suits you, don't wear the pressure of marriage. Do not wear the stress of hiding your sexuality. Release the oxytocin, embrace your needs. Buy the laciest of the laciest of the laciest lingerie for the multiple red hot nights to come. If you are a woman who believes that age is just a number, <laughs> which it is, wear a pink outfit with red lips. Wear a giant hat at brunch. Wear heels, you know, just casually. But don't wear the fear of indulging in vanity. Because girl, camouflaging is so boring. If you are a woman who's unapologetic about what you want for yourself, if you are someone who feels that having children is like wearing a corset under a beige bodycon dress that enhances your image but feels claustrophobic, don't wear the guilt of not having any maternal instincts. Stop wearing the habit of pleasing everyone, just like you stopped wearing flared denims with wedge heels eons ago. Do I need to say it? Knee first is the only carb you need to load on. So basically, your outfit of the day is your mind. And that comes only in one size. Double X me.